bring greetings from the city of Edmonton. Thanks, Angie. Um, good morning, kids. Isn't this cool? Yeah, this is this is fantastic. Well, I um, uh, I'm very pleased to be here with uh, council colleagues, Council McKenna, Councilor Hamilton, and uh, with so many colleagues from the city of Edmonton. Not just the, the zoo team, but so many folks from infrastructure services and community services uh, who've labored to make this project a success, uh, including our city manager Linda Cochran, who at one time ran this. Uh, that was quite her. So congratulations to your whole team, Linda, for this remarkable accomplishment today. Uh, like many of you, I have uh, fond memories of the zoo from my childhood. My grandma lived just up the hill in Valley View, and so this was a favorite destination of ours. And uh, all I wanted to do when I grew up was work at the zoo and drive the train. But now that there's no train, um, I'm just going to put $4.2 billion worth of LRT in. So, there are my speaking notes. All right, now we're winging it. So, uh, that's okay, that's okay. So let me see. Let me see if I can do this off the top of my head. So, um, uh, so I have great fondness for the zoo as well, and uh, I'm glad to be here. Thank you for that. Good save. Uh, I'm glad to be here with all of you today to celebrate uh, again the work of, of so many folks to make this possible. And uh, I want to start by saluting uh, the Valley Zoo Development Society and the philanthropists and the supporters, the people who have labored, particularly as volunteers, uh, to bring community resources to bear. Uh, to make today possible. So let's give um, 